Tucked away just a few hundred metres south of Manchester Airport is a superb example of serious technology from a different age. Quarry Bank is one of the best preserved mills from the early industrial age. Built in 1784, it's hard to believe that just 50 years later it was the largest factory of its type in the country. And at that time, that also meant it was the largest in the world. Quarry Bank spun and wove cotton. And today, the working mill still produces calico. As it was built before the Great Age of Steam, power comes from the river to drive a water wheel. Through a system of shafts and belts, that wheel in turn drives the looms and the other mill machinery. When Quarry Bank opened in 1784, the owner, Samuel Gregg, needed a sizeable workforce, which he housed in a purpose-built factory village. Style. It is the least altered and perhaps best preserved industrial village of its type, and is now in the hands of the National Trust. Gregg also built a school with separate entrances for boys and girls. By the standards of the time, the children were well looked after, and Greg was provided with a ready supply of new hands to work in his mill. 